nobody told me nobody told me that marriage life is kind of marriage is a whole lot of work on its own at a point i think i i i, I got depressed i don't know if I, should, if I should call it depressed but if anything happens to you if anything happens to your head <laughs> like how will you be able to take care of your husband and your boy? hi guys how are you guys doing it's been a minute it's been a while it's been three weeks since i stopped posting on youtube guys and honestly i did not do it intentionally let me just come here and just confess i didn't do it intentionally a lot has been happening guys a lot has been happening nobody told me nobody told me that marriage life is kind of a little bit busy like the process of homemaking trying to like take care of your home like it's a lot it's a lot it's a lot guys it's a lot today i just want to come here and just share with you guys everything that has been going on in my life every update everything 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 so let me just let me just go straight into the video okay so guys first of all look at my new hair that i made i made this hair three days ago this hair is so pretty so fine this is the first time that i'm i'm trying this type of um color like i'm using this kind kind of color for my hair and this is also the first time that i am actually making this style this coily style i saw it on someone on youtube and i was like oh my god this hair is really really pretty i'm like i'm gonna try this style let me see if it's going to look good on me so guys take a look at my new braids let me know in the comment section what you think about this hair if it's really giving i know it's giving but i just want to hear from you guys to know if it's actually giving okay the reason why i stopped posting is because i have been sick guys i have been really really sick i felt sick since like two three weeks ago and i had to like go see the doctor and it was malaria i had malaria one plus so i have to be on medication for weeks and um from malaria i started having cough and kata you can even hear it in my voice that my voice is kind of a bit cracked because of the cough i'm still like taking treatment on for that i'm still trying to like um take some tablets and some syrup to just clear it up so that is what i am currently doing guys it has really really been a lot like nobody told me that marriage life can really really be this ethic like trying to make your home trying to navigate as a newly um bride trying to like navigate this marriage life is a whole lot a whole lot on its own like marriage is a whole lot of work on its own like apart from co uh, creating content and you know um focusing on my business marriage on its own is a whole lot of work and nobody told me about this honestly so when i went to see the doctor he said that i should start i should start prioritizing my head putting my head like i should not stress myself too much when i know that i'm doing too much and i'm getting tired i should just relax myself i should not overstress myself because it really really tells on me and it also like gave me this advice that as a woman you are trying to take care of your home trying to take care of your husband and you are not putting your health first if anything happens to you if anything happens to your head <laughs> like how will you be able to take care of your husband and your home so you have to make sure that you uh, you are taking care of your head make sure your head is your number one priority okay rest when you need to rest and if you know you cannot do something just try to put it aside when you know you have the strength for it you can go you can go back to it and continue for where you stop okay don't stress yourself too much okay take things easy i'm just like telling this to myself because this is what the doctor told me so i'm just like reminding myself of what the doctor told me and also reminding every new bride out there if you know you are new you just got to the marriage life really you're still trying to like find your way find your like find your ground on this marriage stuff just try to take this easy for yourself okay all right be like give yourself some grace okay you deserve it okay and guys i also had another thing i had a creative block at a point i think i i i, I got depressed i don't know if I, should, if I should call it depressed but at a point i could not even like think i was trying to like think 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 what am i going to create now there was a, a lot of topics to talk about but i just don't know where to start from i just don't know what to like how to go about the whole idea how to plan because me i'm someone that i don't really script out my my content i just go with the flow if i have any idea on my head or i have any topic to talk about i just go and do my research on that topic and then 
I make my video. I don't have any script at or anything. Or if I even like to jot, I just jot at the bullet points and I go ahead and make my video. So, but for the past few weeks, I wasn't able to like come up with any idea or to even make any video. I was just like a bit done. But some other things that have been keeping me going was because that I have been on TikTok and I was able to create one or two videos on TikTok and um, two brands reached out to me and one of the brands is Medicube. They gave me their Age Arrow Booster Pro as a, as a gift, as a gift honestly. So when I was feeling down, I was like, oh, I have this creative blog. I could not even do anything. I could not even post anything on my, on my um, page, on my channel. This was some of the things that I got as free gift from Korean, from brands from Korean, and it just made me realize that. Let me open it for you guys first. So this is it. So this is what I got. It's like a a device that you can use to like um, add some extra glow on your skin. So this is what I got for free, and this is just like to motivate me. I just see it as a as a motivation that oh okay. I still have it in there. I still have that skills in there because for brands to think, believe in me that I can, you know, showcase their products and you know, um, deliver something for them. So I still believe that I still got that ginger, that talent, that skills inside of me. So yeah. So it has really, really encouraged me to pick up my camera and continue creating this content for you guys. Anyways, guys, that's um on the content creation aspect. And um, I also want to say this for every YouTuber, every small YouTuber like myself, because these are some of the things that have really hindered me in terms of like going really broad with my content. I have always stick to one niche, skincare, skincare. But now I just want to go broad with my content. I just want you guys to get to know me personally and things that I love, my values, things that I like and things that I don't like. And, you know, just my point of view on some things, my opinion on some on some things and how i see life my perspective about life i just want you guys to get to know me better so i think i'm going to be doing um uh, more of like um vlogs and also um i was talking about skincare but i was going to try and start doing more vlogs for you guys to get to know me and my personality and all of that okay and some of all these big creators will tell you that oh you don't really uh, need to post lifestyle content you don't need to post it by yourself just post about things, about teach people things, let people know, um, give value, um, post things about um, things that can educate people and all of that. Honestly, that is really good. That is, I'm not saying that those advice are bad, but now we live in a world where every day we keep evolving and we, we get to see new things, new ideas and all of that. So when it comes to... Um, creating content on youtube i would say for you to be yourself okay be yourself on this platform be yourself whether you have content to create about your lifestyle post it whether you, you have um content to create about ed ed educative content also post that okay just post anything that you feel like you have passion for that you are happy posting just post it it might not make sense at some point but at the long run trust me it's going to make sense okay so enough of these people telling you to niche down, niche down, niche down, niche down, and stick with the what's um, just uh, educating people on this platform. Also, people want to get to know you. People want to get to know your life, what you what, um, what you value in life, your value, what you like. People, your real audience, really want to get to know those things. So, I think for me, moving forward, I'm going to like creating content about my life, about some things that I really want to share with you guys. Okay, so. You guys should know me better and not just, oh, she's a skincare girl, okay? Yeah. <laughs> See, another thing that I want to tell you guys is, if you are buying skincare products this period, if you have the money, please buy it in two. Buy it in two because what happened to me recently is that I got a sunscreen and I, just, and I got just one sunscreen. And my sunscreen is almost finished. Like, it's just little that is remaining currently. And I'm just thinking of, am i going to get money to buy another one <laughs> because i really don't know how to go about it honestly because i already like order for some product that will be coming and i want to wait for that product to come i don't want to go ahead and buy another one when i already like order for product that's coming already so i don't know if you guys understand but that's just the story of my life right now so 
if that's what I'm saying. If you are buying skincare product and you have the money to buy it in two, just go for two. But if you don't have money at all to buy it in two, if you have money to just buy your sunscreen in two, please go ahead and buy it in two because the sunscreen you get to buy these days, they are really, really small, like really, really small. The, the containers is really, really small. So if even though you're not buying all your skincare products in two, but try and get your sunscreen in two. This is the act that I want to start doing and I think it's also going to benefit you guys. So if you are buying your skincare product and you want to buy your skincare, your and you want to buy your sunscreen, try and get your sunscreen in two. Even though you're not getting any other product in two, but make sure you get your sunscreen in two because it's really, really going to help you at the long run. I know I'm saying this because skincare is really, really expensive these days and a lot of people are complaining. Like a lot of people are complaining. Do you know that? After I'm making this video now, I'm going to pick up um, the rice that we got for the house. Rice now, full bag of rice is 115k. Just to get rice that they, they were selling 1000 naira for the 5000 naira for a bag. That was last year, I think, last year, last year. Now they are selling this the same rice <laughs> for 115,000 naira. So you see that things are really, really expensive, and a lot of people are complaining. A lot of people are going through a lot this period. So. If you have the money to get your skincare into, I will advise you to get it into because you know, really, like, you don't know what will happen next. So please get your skincare into if you can. Okay? okay I think I've said it all, and uh, yeah, look forward to see more of my content because I am coming here with a full force. I know I've said this several times that oh, I'm going to start creating content, blah blah blah, and I end up, you know. Um, post one or two content and I disappear but this time around I'm saying this that expect more content from me and I want you guys to also drop it in the comment section like what topic do you want me to discuss about and if you have any questions please do where to leave it in the comment section okay let me know your questions and I will be in the comment section replying all your questions like let's just have a discussion in the comment section okay and I'll see you guys in my next video until then bye